of loss. Without closure for this family, three years ago, a Keithville woman named Crystal Bill went missing. The Caddo Sheriff's Office continues to investigate, but have nothing to go on. I spoke with her mother about her disappearance and the link she's gone trying to find her. It's been almost three years now. Nobody's heard a word from her. But nothing on social media, nothing on her phone. Melody Bill is a heartbroken mother, left wondering what happened to her daughter, Crystal Bill. And we just want to know what happened to her. Good, bad, or indifferent. We need some closure. She has brothers and, and she has a son. And we just want this to be over. Melody reported Crystal missing on November 18th, 2018. She was 30 years old at the time. And Melody is now raising Crystal's nine-year-old son. He worries about his mama because he was old enough when she left to know that was his mama. And when he asked her, is my mama, is my mama dead? I don't know what to tell him. I can't say yeah, I mean, because I don't know for sure. Crystal Bill's case is under investigation by the Caddo Parish Sheriff's Office. Their reports place her missing on August 7, 2018, when she was allegedly dropped off in Shreveport's Highland neighborhood. Last month, I spoke with detectives about Crystal's case and was told there are no new clues or information. Somebody knows, and they can go tell somebody. They don't want to get in trouble. Nobody has to know who said it. If somebody would just tell somebody, Crime Stoppers, the TV station, somebody. Millie says her daughter suffered with drug addiction and wonders if her case is taken less seriously because of it. It makes me wonder if they're looking for her at all, but I would like to think that they're looking for her as far as they would somebody else just because she did drugs and had a few problems it shouldn't matter after so long with nothing to go on melody took it upon herself to investigate her daughter's disappearance following her own leads and even going to known drug dealers houses now i've tried everything i've beat on doors i've talked to people I've tried social media. Even when it's cost her. About a year ago, Melody permanently injured her leg. I was at somebody's house thinking I could find her or find out some information and literally fell off their porch. And I've been kind of crippled ever since. Melody says she's even had to leave social media. She was getting fake calls and messages from scammers demanding money in exchange for information on Crystal. It's too much for me mentally. It's just too much, and there's too many people out there telling falsehoods that lead me off in directions I don't need to go. So I backed off from it, and I'm just in limbo. I'm just waiting. At this point, Melody just wants closure for her family. And if she is deceased, if I could get her body back so we could be done and have some closure, because our life has been permanently changed. And we don't know how to get it back. Now you just heart breaks for Melody. Well, Melody has submitted her DNA in case a body is ever found. She can be matched to her family. Anyone with information on Crystal's disappearance is urged to contact the Caddo Parish Sheriff's Office.